Hello, good evening. Hello, good uh, evening. Can you hear me? Good evening. Yes. Yeah. Good right. evening, Hello, good evening. Good to see you. How are you today? Fine, fine. Yeah. Okay, good. I'm I'm ex um I'm very happy to Hello, good evening. Okay, good. I'm very happy to see uh, many of you today. Good How, hello, good evening. How was your um how was your day today? Did you have a good day? Yes. Yeah. It was good. That's yeah. good. Oh, excellent. I like I like to hear that. Sorry? Sorry, I didn't I, I I didn't hear what you said. Can you repeat that? Okay. Or maybe I I, I got confused. Okay. All right, guys and girls, we're going to right now take attendance. So I would like um, you to pay attention to your name. Um, Ana Isela Janis. Present teacher. Excellent. Ana Ruth Perez. Ana Ruth Perez Leiva. Carlos Ernesto Flores. Carlos Ernesto Flores. Uh, Diana Cristabel Meléndez. Diana Cristabel Meléndez. Uh, Gerardo José Tepas. Gerardo José Tepas. ¿no? Um, José Mauricio Martínez. I'm here. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Um, Juana Mar Margarita Sea. Juan Juana Margarita Sea. Catherine Suleima Puka Sangre. Present. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Uh, uh, we can't see you, Catherine. Um, can you turn on your camera, please? Catherine? Ah, there she is. Wonderful. Thank you. Okay. Um, Catherine Nicola Salazar. Present teacher. Wonderful. Okay. Thank you for connecting, Catherine. Um, Kat, uh, Kat, uh, Jordano Dos Cruz, uh, Cruces Guerrero. Present teacher. Wonderful, thank you very much. Uh, Laura Lisa Peña. Present teacher. Wonderful, thank you. Lorena Deceli Hernandez de Garcia. Present teacher. Excellent, thank you. Uh, Melissa Cecilia Beltran. Present teacher. Okay, wonderful. Mirna del Carmen Ruano. Present. Excellent. Oscar Otaniel Cruz Guzman. Present. All right, excellent. Uh, Roberto Carlos Alparo Alberto. Present. All right. Uh, Salvador Antonio Martinez Serrano. Salvador Antonio Martinez Serrano. Sebastiana Guadalupe Aguilar. Present teacher. Wonderful, thank you very much. Uh, Tamara Eugenia Aguilar. Present. Thank you. And Ursula Adriana Burgos. Ursula Adriana Burgos Enriquez. Okay. 
All right, thank you very much, guys. Just a reminder to everybody that I need your cameras on. Uh, this is something that in support eh, asks that your cameras are on. Veo que algunos um, lo enciende un ratito, después lo apagan. Uh, un recordatorio que eh, la cámara debe estar encendida en todo momento. Eh, porque esos son los lineamientos de INSAFOR. Entonces, eh, todos nos hemos comprometido a esos lineamientos, por lo tanto, necesitamos acatarlos. Okay? Um, if you have any inconvenience, please let us know. But other than that, you should be with your camera on. Okay, so, um, all right, so we're going to start the class, everybody. Um, please uh, tell me if uh, you are able to um, see my screen. Yes. Yeah. Wonderful. Okay. So this is a conversation um, between Marie and Paul and from before, we were talking about sports and um, what are they called? And fitness activities. So we're gonna, they're gonna, they're going to be discussing precisely um, a fitness activities. So listen. Oh no! Wait a second. Yeah, we already practiced this, but what we're gonna do right now is the following. Um, we're going to be noticing. Uh, Remember yesterday we talked about the adverbs of frequency? Do you remember that? Yes. Okay. Often, so what we... how often. Mm -hmm. Exactly. So often, how often, um, hardly ever. Often. Hardly what ever, else? never. Never, et cetera, et cetera. Okay. So let's take a look in this conversation, okay? It says here, um, how often, notice, how often do you exercise like that? And notice the answer that, that um, Marie gives. She says, about five times a week. What does that mean, five times a week? I have I have ever. Right, yes, very good. But let's talk about this one, five times a week. What does that mean? Five times a it week. It means that he train, he trains five days. Exactly. So it trains, it means that um, in a week that has seven days, five of those days, um, she exercises. Okay. So it means only two days she doesn't exercise. Five days she exercises, two she rests. Okay. Yeah. All right. Now, if he said, eh, sorry, that was Paul. Sorry, that's Paul that, that exercises five times a week. Now, Marie, she says, I hardly ever exercise. It means I hardly ever. It means that she exercises, but maybe she exercises once a month. Right? One time in 30 days. Right, in every month, maybe one time, two times, you know, it's not a very frequent amount of time. Okay. She and then Marie says, I usually just watch TV in my free time. So usually means that most of the time, maybe 70% of the time, she watches TV in her free time. Okay. Do we understand this vocabulary? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes. Yes. Good. And notice what we were talking about yesterday that af that um after the frequency we use the verb in the infinitive form. So we don't change it. So I hardly ever so how often do you exercise? I hardly ever exercise. 
I usually just watch TV. So we use the the original form, the base form. Does that make sense? Does that make sense for everybody? Yeah? Yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we're going to now do some exercises regarding that. Oops, sorry. Um, here we go. The, these are the exercises. So it says, put the adverbs in the correct place, then practice with a partner. So we have the we have a question here. It says, do you play sports? Now we have to put the word ever, that is in parentheses, in the correct position in the question. Okay. Excited. So we have uh, twice a week, we put in the correct place, usually, almost always, often, hardly ever, always, never, usually, about three times a week. So those phrases, we're going to be um, included. Yeah, we're going to be putting them in the correct place. Sounds okay. good? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right, guys. Um, so what we'll do is um, I'm going to be sharing this exercise in um, the WhatsApp group. Okay. Um, and we're going to be working together with a partner in a breakout room so that we can complete the exercise. So um, let me see, just give me a moment while well, I send it to you guys. Okay. Do you have it? Did you receive it? Yes. I got it. Perfect. Yeah. Okay, good. So, yeah, okay, good. All right, I want to make sure that everybody's here because once again, I see that your cameras are off and I do understand that when we go to like, for example, WhatsApp or another application, the cameras turn off, but I need to make sure everybody's here. So can you please everybody turn back your cameras on? because I'm not sure who's here. So I do not see Melissa Beltran. Por cierto, Melissa, I need you to um, change your name so that it's complete. Okay. And I don't see okay. Catherine. Thank you. I don't see Catherine Zuleima, Catherine Nicole, uh, Gerardo Jose Tepas. I don't see Diana Cristabel. I don't see Carlos Ernesto, Lorena Aracelli. Can you please turn on your camera so I know that you're there? Because are you there? I'm not sure. Because I also need to put you into breakout rooms, but if you're not there, then I'm going yes, to- Yes, sir, I am here. Okay. Pero tengo poca carga, entonces para el último momento la estoy. Ajá, pero sí que estoy. Okay, so you're there. Um, uh -huh. Are you going to participate, Diana? Yes. Perfect, okay. And Catherine, Nicole, you're going to be participating? Teacher, I'm going to my house now. Okay, are you driving? Yes. Oh, okay. We don't want you to have an accident. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, Carlos Ernesto Flores. Carlos Ernesto Flores, not here. Lorena Araceli Hernandez. Hola. Oh. Hola, buenas noches. Hello, Carlos. Can you hear us? Hello. Hi. Can you hear us? 
Can you hear me, Carlos? Okay, so I'm going to put you guys right now into the groups um, to complete the exercise. And I'll give you about, I would say about four minutes. I don't think it should take you too long because all you have to do is insert the correct, the word in the correct position. So it shouldn't take you too long. So I'll give you about four minutes to complete it and then we'll come back and we'll check the answers. Okay, so here we go. Do you play sport? Uh, the correct mm -hmm. form for me is, is do you ever play sport? Ah, sería, I ever play sport. Sería así. No, you're not answering. Mm -hmm. You're just putting it no. in the correct place. All you're doing is putting the word in the correct place. You're not answering it. Okay. Does that make sense? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Okay. Hello, Lorena. Lorena, are you there? Hello, teacher. Aquí estoy. Okay. All right. Okay. So you guys are, are right now taking a break, I guess, right? Okay. All right. I'll see you in a moment. Do you always exercise on Sundays? No, I never exercise on Sundays. What do you usually do after class? I go out with my classmates about three times a week. Okay. Ya practicamos dos veces, teacher. Um... Okay, so you? you already put the in, in the correct position. You put the words in the correct position, right? Yeah. I think we are. All right, perfect. We're gonna check this uh, this the exercise in a moment. Okay, uh, we're gonna go back to the main room. Okay. All right, guys, we're going to be checking the answers now. Um, so please tell me if uh, you can see my, um, my, my screen. Mm -hmm. 
Yes. Yeah. Everybody, everybody can see my screen. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Perfect. All right. So let's start with the first part. Do you play sports? Do you ever? Good. Okay. Um. So what I'll do is I'll just put like a what we call a carrot. So do you ever play uh -huh. sports? It's gonna put there. That's what we call a uh -huh. carrot. So do you ever play sports? Good. Yeah. Sure. Sure. I play soccer twice a week. He, uh, we can use that word at the beginning of the of the of the word. Can I say twice a week I play soccer or not? Right. Or not? Yeah. You're you're absolutely yeah. right. Yes, you could say I play soccer twice a week. Yeah. Okay. It's possible. Is there mm -hmm. a, um, is it what I twice a week play soccer? No. Um, no. That is no. not possible. So twice a week is a long um period of time. Uh, yes, yes, but it's also a long frequency. Okay. Uh -huh. So when because it's not like um it's not a frequency adverb, it's a frequency phrase. And when it's a frequency phrase, if a phrase means that it's long, when it's a frequency phrase then you can put it only at the beginning of a sentence or at the end of a sentence. Okay, mm -hmm. so I could put it, I could put right. it here or I could put it here. So it would look, it would look like this. Sure. I play soccer twice a week. Wait. Or sure. Sure. Yeah. Twice a week. I play, comma, I play soccer. Okay. So the that's the only the only two places where it's possible to to use the frequency phrase. Either at the end, twice a week. Or at the beginning of the sentence. Does that make sense? Yes. Yes. Yes, yes teacher. Thank you. Okay. Wonderful. Any other questions? No. Okay. Okay. Next. What do you do on Saturday mornings? What do you usually do? Good. What do you usually do on Saturday mornings? What do you usually do on Saturday mornings? Okay. Next, nothing much. I almost always sleep until noon. Good. I almost always sleep until noon. I almost always sleep until noon. Next, do you do you often do yeah. aerobics at the gym? Good. Do you often do aerobics at the gym? Yes. Do you often do aerobics at the gym? No, I do aerobics. I hardly ever do aerobics. Excellent. I hardly ever do aerobics. I hardly ever do aerobics. Do you exercise on Sundays? Do you always exercise on Sundays? Good. Do you always? Do you always? Exercise on Sundays? Do you always exercise on Sundays? No, I exercise on Sundays. No, I never exercise on Sundays. Excellent. No, I never exercise on Sundays. Excellent. What do you do after class? 
What do you usually Good. do? What do you usually do after this? Remember, it has to go before the verb. Next. And the last one, I go out with my classmates about three, three times a week. Good. I go out with my classmates about three times a week or... Or... About three times a about week. About three times a week, I go out with my classmates. Exactly. Or about three times a week, I go out with my classmates. So I'll write it out so that you understand what I'm saying. But I can say I go out with my classmates about three times a week or about three times a week, comma, I go out with my classmates. Okay, if you're going to put it at the beginning though, just be careful that you um, use the comma, okay? So you have to use a comma if you're gonna put it at the beginning. Does that make sense? Right there. Yes. Okay, any questions? Do you have any questions? Um, uh, when it's a question, uh, it's always the, in the order, right? So when it's a question, like for example, do you do aerobics at the gym? And you would say, do you often? So just make sure that um, if we, we follow the same structure where you have the subject, then um, then we have the, the adverb or frequency, okay? And then we have the verb, do, for example, okay? Or over here, right? What uh, what do you usually do? So here we have you is a subject, then the frequency adverb usually, and then do as the the verb. Okay, thank you. Thank you. Any other any other questions? So it's clear for you? Yes. Crystal clear. Yeah, it's crystal clear. Yes. Okay. Good. All right, guys and girls. Um, so we are going to continue here uh, with the next part of our class. Um, just give me a moment. Please tell me if you are able to see my screen. Yeah, do you see my screen? Yes. Okay. Yes. All right, so we have some questions here. Do you have a regular fitness program? How often do you exercise? Do we understand these questions? It's question number one. Yes, no, do we understand that? Yes. Yeah? Yeah. yeah. Good. Next, number two. Do you ever go to a gym? Do we understand this question? Do you ever go to a yes. gym? Yeah? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. How often do you go? What do you do there? Do we understand those questions? Oh, yes. Yeah? 
Okay, good. Do you play any sports? Which ones? How often do you play them? Do you understand those questions? Yes. Yeah, so far so good. Yes. Teacher, I don't understand. Do you ever go to the gym? Do you ever go to the gym? It means at some moment in your life, or not in your life, but at some moment, uh, do you go to the gym? Like, so um, maybe you don't go to the gym every day or every week, but maybe you go to the gym twice a month, right? So, um, or sometimes you go to the gym and then you stop going to the gym. Oh, and then you continue maybe three months later. That's what it means. It means so. Do you ever means at some moment do you go to the gym? Does that make sense? Okay. Yes. And yeah. how often do you go? Uh, um, always, never. Yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Next we have, do you ever take long walks? How often? Where do you go? Do you understand those questions? Yes. Yes? Everybody understands those questions? Yes, yes. Yes, teacher. Yeah? Okay, good. Uh, next we have, what else do you do to keep fit? What else do you do to keep fit? Um, any questions about those? Any questions about those questions? No. No. Okay. Good. Um, okay. So these questions are going, if you ask these questions, they're going to require that you, um, they're going to require that you answer with an adverb of frequency. So I never go to the gym. I usually go to the gym. Um, I often exercise. Um, I hardly ever exercise. Um, I never do sports, uh, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Or I go for lo I go for a long walk twice a week, et cetera, et cetera. So what we're going to do right now is we're going to put you guys into the same groups that you were before. You're going to be asking your partner these or your partner, your partner or your partners these questions, and you're going to be answering also your partner. Does that make sense? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right. So we're going to stop sharing. And I'm going to be sending this through WhatsApp. You have it? Yes, I got it. Perfect. All right, so I'm going to be opening up the breakout rooms and I'm gonna give you a few minutes to answer these questions. Okay. Um, okay. Okay. So here we go. Let's open.
programa regular. Entonces, tenemos que contestar. Uh, ¿Hace ejercicio o no? Regularmente. ¿O tenés un programa de... de, de... Ok, so remember, sí, sí, sí. so girls, remember that the exercise is in English so that we can practice English. Okay, so don't ask the questions in Spanish. Ask the questions in English and answer in English. Okay? okay. All right. Great. And that's... <laughs> Hi. Yes. In the first. I usually exercise. Usually. Yes. Um, I am, I'm not, not exercise in my answers is nothing, nothing much, nothing much. I, so no, so what was the question? Can you repeat the question? Do you have a regular fitness program? Okay. And what is your answer? Um, nothing much. I know I have never exercised. Perfect. Perfect. There you go. So the idea is to practice using adverbs of frequency and adverb phrases. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, yes. Very good. Continue, girls. In the second question, did you have how often? Bueno, ahora pregunto. Yes. Okay. Do you have a regular fitness program? No, I don't have. Uh, sorry okay. to interrupt, um, but uh, I, Juana, I need you to do me a favor. Can you please change your name in the platform so it's complete? Because right now you only appear as Juana Sea. So I need you to put your complete name. Okay. All right, you can continue. Pretend that I'm not here and, and continue asking the questions. Okay. Uh, do you ever go, go to a gym? Um, I sometimes go to the gym. How often do you go? Uh -huh. Uh, I go to a gym two times a week. Okay. And not much, really. Okay. What do you do there? Uh, I use I usually use um the bicycle. Okay. And. Um, ¿Cómo es que se decía el levantamiento de pesos? Ok. ¿Do you play any sport? Yes, I do. Which one? I play soccer. Ok. How often do you play soccer? Mm, sometimes. 
Okay. Do you ever take long walks? Sorry. Do you ever take long walks? Yes, I do. Okay. How often? Ay, qué difícil. Es difícil en inglés. Pues en Tavi. Uso las mancuernas. La barra, pero. Hace bastante que ya no. Ok. So, Do you play? Try to, play any... try to, sorry, sorry, girls. Just try to practice English because that's the idea of this class, right? To practice English. So. Uh, try to ask the questions in English and try to answer in English. Okay. 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 Do you play any sports? Yeah, I know. No. I know. Play. I never play sports. Okay, do you ever take long walks? Yes, with uh, yes, I usually with my mom. How often in the street? In the street. In the street. How do you say cerca in en English? El qué? ¿Cómo se dice cerca en en English? Near? So ask in English, how do you say? How do you say cerca in English? Yeah, so yeah, you can say near. Mm -hmm. Near. Uh, I usually walk near in the street of my house. Okay, uh, y la última, what else do you, what else do you to keep fit? Do you do? Um, what else do you do? Do you do? Mm -hmm. um, only walk. Okay. Okay. We're going to bring everybody back. Okay. 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 All right, guys and girls. Okay. Um, any questions about the vocabulary, uh, about um, what you the what you had to answer? Mm, yes, I got one question, okay. but I don't know if it's wrong or if it's right. Okay. When I ask this question, let me see. Do you have a regular fitness program? Can I answer? I don't have a regular fitness. Uh, I don't have a fitness program. Can I answer? I don't okay. have a regular fitness program. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes. I don't yeah. have a fitness program. Can yeah. I answer? Like that. Okay. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> mm -hmm. Yeah, that's fine. It's because fine. you are asking for uh, 
for a program for something that you will will be do in a in a gym, I guess. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's fine. But if that you are fine. asking about um, regular routines, mm -hmm. you can answer with ever, hardly ever, always. Mm -hmm. Yes. Is that correct? Okay. Yes, Thank you. you can. Absolutely. Yeah. Thank you. You're welcome. Okay. Um, all right, guys. Uh, remember, uh, we need cameras on. I Right now, I only see half of the class. So remember, cameras need to be on. Juana, your your name is still appears like Juana Sea. So I need you to put your your complete name. Okay. By the way, everybody, um, since we're talking about uh, vocabulary, um, I want you to understand that there are two ways of pronouncing the word O F T E N. We can say often or often. The two forms are valid. And one form is more American and the other one is more British. So if you want to be more British, you say often, you pronounce the T. And if it's more American, it would be more like often, often. So the two forms are correct. Okay. okay. Any questions? No. Okay. All right. Um, please tell me if you can see the com the conversation here. Yes. Yeah, everybody can see it. Okay. Yes. Yes. Right. Okay. Yes. All right. So practice with me. You're in okay. great shape, Keith. You're in great shape, Keith. Everybody. You are in a great shape, Casey. You are in great shape. Thanks. 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 I guess I'm a real fitness freak. I guess I'm a real fitness freak. Fitness freak. Fitness freak. Fitness freak. Fitness freak. Fitness freak. 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 How often? Often. How often? Do you work out? Do you work out? Well, I do aerobics. Well, I, I do a rowing. I do a rowing. Twice a week. Twice a week. Twice a week. Twice a week. Tennis? Tennis. 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 That sounds like a lot of fun. That sounds like a lot of fun. Oh. Sorry, guys. I just realized I skipped the line. Yes. Um, and I play tennis every week. And I play tennis every week. Every week. Every week. Tennis. 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 That sounds tennis. like a lot of fun. That sounds, that like, sounds a like a lot of fun. Oh. 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 Do you want to play sometime? Do you want, to, you play want to play some time? Uh, how well do you play? Uh, how well, do you, how well, do, you how well do you play? Pretty well, I guess. Pretty well, I guess. Pretty well, I guess. Pretty well, I guess. well, all right. Well, well, all right. Well, all right. But I'm not very good. But I'm, but I'm not, not very good. good. But they're not very good. No problem. No problem. No problem. No problem. I'll give you a few tips. I'll give you a few I'll tips. I'll give you a few tips. Yeah. Good. Perfect. All right. Bravo. All right. I need now two volunteers. One to be Ruth and the other one to be Keith. Who wants to be Ruth? 
volunteer, you can put your 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 you can raise your your virtual hand. Thank you. All right, perfect. Anna Ruth, you can be Ruth, <laughs> and Kathy, uh, you can be um, Keith. Okay. 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 You are in a great shape, Keith. Thanks. I guess I'm a real fitness freak. How often do you work out? Well, I do aerobics twice a week. And I play tennis every week. Tennis? That sounds like a lot of fun. Oh, do you want to play sometime? Oh, how well do you play? Pretty well, I guess. Well, all right. But I'm not very good. No problem. I will give you a few tips. Bravo, girls. Bravo, bravo. Okay, two more people. Two more people to help me. Who wants to be Ruth? Who wants to be Keith? Okay, wonderful. Um, all right, so we'll have, let's see, Sebastiana, you can be Ruth. And Catherine Suleima, you can be Keith. Okay, you're in great shape, Keith. Thanks. I guess I'm a real fitness freak. How often do you work out? Well, I do aerobics twice a week and I play tennis every week. Tennis? That sounds like a lot of fun. Oh, do you want to play sometime? Uh, how well do you play? Ooh, oh, how... <laughs> Sorry, pretty well, I guess. Well, all right, but I'm not very good. No problem. I'll give you a few tips. Bravo, girls, bravo, excellent. Okay, excellent. All right, so if you notice this, um, in this conversation, they asked a lot of questions. Um, and that's actually what we're gonna be learning right now. We're gonna be learning with Questions with how, okay? Oh, hold on. I know what happened. Let me stop sharing for a moment. Let me share, Let me share again. What happened here? Okay, sorry girls and guys, I don't know what, what happened, but okay. But bring it, I think you can still see it, so I'll project like this. Okay, so questions and with um, how and short answers. So we have, how often do you work out? Okay, so how often means what is the frequency that you work out, how often? Okay, usually you say, how often do you? How often do you work out? How often do you go to the gym? How often do you um, swim in the ocean, et cetera, et cetera? And there's another question. How often do you play tennis? Sorry, sorry, how well do you play tennis, right? How well do you play tennis? So how well means you want to know if the person does the activity really good, they are very good at it, or they're not very good at it. The other question is, how long do you spend at the gym? How long do you, so that you want to know the time, this is for time, okay? So here, this is like, you wanna know the, the level of the person. Here, you want to know the time, okay? And this one, how good are you at sports? How good is the same idea as how well, okay? So how good are you? It's the same idea. You want to know the level of the person, okay? So how often you're asking about frequency? Okay, 
how often, how well and how good you're asking about the level, and how long you're asking about the period of time. Okay? Okay, so period of time, so two hours, 30 minutes, um, you know, 45 minutes, an hour and a half, three hours, et cetera, et cetera. Okay, so what are some of the answers that you can give? Well, some of the answers are, for example, um, you can say, how often do you work out every day? What is Once every day? What is every day? Todos los días. Twice a week. What is twice a week? Dos veces a la semana. Dos veces a la semana. Not very often. No tan frecuente, no tan seguido. No tan frecuente, no tan seguido. So this is talking about frequency. All of these are answering about frequency. How well do you play tennis? So you want to know the level. You can say pretty well. In Spanish, pretty well. Muy bien. Mm -hmm. But it's like saying, um, bastante bien. Okay. Más o menos bien, entonces. Pretty well. No, pretty well is bastante bien. Bastante bien. Okay. Okay. About average. So you're saying, um, I'm, I'm okay. Not very well. So you're saying, it's, Nada bien. I, I don't have a very good level. The same thing here. Pretty good. Pretty good is the same idea. Pretty good. Pretty well. Okay. Not so good. So the same the same idea. So if you notice, these ones are talking about level. And finally, how long do you spend at the gym? We we're talking about a period of time. So you can say 30 minutes a day. In Spanish, 30 minutes a day. 30 minutes a day? 30 minutes a day. 30 minutes a day. Two hours a week? Dos horas a la semana? Dos horas a la semana. About an hour on weekends. Sobre una hora los fines de semana? Como una hora los fines de semana. Very good. So those are talking about a period of time. Any questions about this? No. No. All right, we're no. going to stop there then. We're going to stop our class. Quickly take attendance. Um, Anna is still a genius. Teacher, I have a question. Mm -hmm. Present teacher. Okay, wonderful. Somebody had a question? Um, What's the meaning about in the sentence about means approximately oh. approximately okay. mm -hmm. well, thank you. you're welcome Ana Ruth Perez present excellent thank you very much uh, Carlos Ernesto Flores Carlos Ernesto Flores Diana Cristabel Melendez present Okay, wonderful. Thank you. Present. Yeah, I, I, I gotcha. Okay, very good. Um, Gerardo uh, Jose Tepas. Gerardo Jose Tepas. I'm here. Okay, wonderful. Thank you. Jose Mauricio Martinez. I'm here. Excellent. Thank you. Juana Margarita Sea. Present teacher. Excellent, thank you. Um, eh, Catherine Suleima Pocasangre. Present. Excellent, thank you. Uh, Catherine Nicole Salazar. Present teacher. Cathy uh, Jordana Dos Cruces. Present teacher. Excellent, thank you. Uh, Laura Lisa Peña Castillo. Excellent, teacher. Excellent, thank you. We had a great time. Um, Lorena Araceli Hernandez. 
Lo Present, voy a leer. teacher. Ok, thank you. Um, Melissa C uh, Celia, sorry, perdón. Melissa Cecilia Betrán. Melissa Cecilia. Present teacher. Good, thank you. Mina del Carmen Rueno. Present teacher. Wonderful. Eh, Oscar Otoniel Cruz. Present. Oscar Otoniel Cruz. Present. Okay. Roberto Carlos Alparo. Present. Salvador Antonio Martínez. Salvador Antonio Martínez. Sebastián, Sebastiana Guadalupe Aguilar. Present teacher. Tamara Eugenia um, Sagastume. Present. Excellent. And finally, Ursula Adriana Burgos. Ursula Adriana Burgos. Okay. All right, guys, that will be all for today. I will see you guys tomorrow, okay? Okay, so, yeah. So, uh, thank you. Take care. All right. Thank you. Thank bye -bye. you. Bye. You're welcome. You too. Have a good, good night. night. Have a good, good night. night. Thank you. Good night. Tomorrow. See you tomorrow.